I'll take a quick look at this outside I'm doing. Silicon over the joint between the brickwork and the frame. I have to take all that off. That's bad. And the reason why is because once that fails, you don't want to know where it's failed and water will get in. So down here, it's already coming away. The gap there. Silicon right onto the brickwork. I'm going to leave that because I'm just, it's just starting to rain and I'm in the process of removing the filleting, cement filleting up the side which has been, um, well I'll show you, silicon again. So we'll just take a look all the way up this edge here was silicon took it out and around the arch of the window there now it's cracking so frame wasn't big enough for the brickwork big void here which was just filled with cement and obviously it cracks and then someone's come along and put silicon all down this side so i've been taking it off you can see where they've Put silicon around this bead here as well which I'm gonna to have to remove but the main priority now is to get this wood sealed get this filled because I don't want any water getting in here because it'll just go straight into the brickwork all right so I'm gonna leave this silicon here for now I don't want to try and start messing around removing this but what I will do is I'll tempt fate I'll sort this out, remove the silicon along the base here. See, I did a repair a while back. I came here just trying to, there was a damp problem behind this window. So, fixed the gutter work, and now I'm here doing the outside. But while I was here, I noticed a big gap. I had my foam, so I put some in. But we'll address all this, get this silicon out of here now. I'm literally just going to pull it off best where I can and then I'll get this paint scraper on it and scrape this brickwork remove it off the brickwork it's, overall it's not too bad just get that gap filled that's the thin thin coat of primer I want it too thick I want it to dry but all this now has done is just giving me protection for the night well actually maybe for the next couple of days because I think we have rain tomorrow don't leave any thick edges just wipe that back it should only take half an hour to dry but again can't have any water going in there so the foam has to go in today so what I will do is give it a quick prime with this. Shouldn't take long for it to dry off enough for me to fill the gap. Because again, it's only a primer. I need to get it waterproof. Oh, the rain's coming down now. Not quite getting to where I'm working, but I'm getting wet. This is dry. I can get this foamed up now. I've had to fix some of these mortar lines where it was gone on the sill so I'll foam those up for now I'll rate them back a bit and then point them up but it's waterproof it's the main thing okay right I'm out of here that's that done for now Okay, following day, I have a quick look at proceedings. So, all the frame now has been sanded down, prepped, removed all the silicon, it's had a good prime, and then all the edges I've knit round 
what I've done with cementing, I can't do yet. Well, that's cemented in there. So I will be doing that bit of cement fillet all the way round. Take a look down this end here now. So, actually, just swap over, get off this ladder, and just get myself onto this one. So this bit of fillet up the side, I've finished. Cut the foam back, sanded it all down, then put some cement into the hole, and then with a piece of timber, I just made the fillet up, but not finished it off too particular, because it fades off and there's hardly anything. So just matching it in with the rest, and then like I say, I am gonna paint it. Well, the main reason being is all the rest of the windows are a little bit odd, different. So I'll just show you. So again, these bottom bits, rake them out and then cemented them. Took a little bit of foam out, like I say, raking out. And they're okay, they'll clean up. Well, that's good. That's waterproof and ready for finishing, really. A bit more primer on these. But other than that, it's looking good. Nothing down here. That's looking fine. good nothing wrong with that so when I say fillets around the rest of the frames if we take a look at this one so all that crack in there on that window upstairs that was just silicon just silicon around those and once they fail they're gone up there how bad that one is so I'll have to address all this and all this will get painted as well so a bit mismatched on this side again a big gap there and then we just look at these windows so this filleton has been painted brown and more gaps underneath that one's been painted brown and this one's been finished black to match with the brickwork, the cement. So I will just paint this face as well when I do the window, leave that edge. So they'll all be looking good. I can quite happily leave this now for a couple of days, probably three days. Just let all this dry out. <laughs> 